Good morning, you guys. So today is Friday. I took out my hair because it's going to get washed, but that's not the case. Today is Friday, and we're here to talk about all things groceries. So I am one week into clean eating, which is no grains, no sugar. And I weighed myself this morning, and I'm down five pounds. Um, so, so excited for that, but let's get into all of the things that we're going to talk about. So I'm going to do an HEB pickup potentially. I wanted to do a bulk buy, but I haven't had time to sit down and look at all of the things. So I think maybe this month we'll do a weekly buy and just like buy the things I need by the week. We will see what happens, but... I have planned, I have it on my phone, so actually I think it will show me in my iPad so I can tell y'all exactly what I plan on cooking. Um, I may switch up some things just depending on what I buy, but let's see if I have it in here. I think I might have just only put it on my Oh, no, here it goes. So I plan on doing salmon. I think we have like two or three salmons in the fridge. So we can go ahead and eat that up for a dinner. I want to buy some codfish. Um, H-E-B has a really good lemon butter cod. So we can enjoy that. I already have beef, so we are going to do tacos again. Um, I want to do our chicken and broccoli recipe. And then maybe some barbecue chicken with cauliflower. Uh, rice, however... They have ribs on sale. So I know that I already have two um, things of ribs to maybe replace that and do two barbecue ribs for dinner or do ribs for dinner with cauliflower rice, maybe some black beans. Um, so we'll see. And then um, let's crazy pantry. Um, because I've been eating clean, I've actually been eating my almonds. This is how much I have left, and this will actually last me at least for next week. So no need to buy any. Yes, big girl. Sorry. Okay, she's good. Um, so no need to buy any um, almonds snacking for me. Baby girl still has some um, veggie straw, so that will last her. We still have some pistachios, so we should be good with that. These are just some chips my husband may eat. And I'm about to go like crazy and just start throwing things away because we've just had so many things for a while that hasn't been eating. Um, I can now and just enjoy some popcorn from time to time. So over the weekend, if I get snacky, I have some popcorn. There's these Wasa crackers in here, but they'll need to go in the garbage. Baby girl has none of her Happy Tot pouches. Um, and she has just one jammy Sammy left. But we have been doing good a little bit with her eating more like food food. Um, my husband still has a whole bunch of these left. And then he still has one of his Celsius over there. We still have some bread to some effect. I'm just making sure y'all my child is okay. Um, baby girl still has some bars over here. This weekend... Um, I think I'm going to make these keto blueberries so I can snack on them or have them for breakfast along with my eggs, but just something else that like I can eat. And then uh, down here is very scanty. Um, yesterday was Halloween, so my husband had some like Halloween candy he got, but everything is pretty much like empty. Um, but she does have her like go-go squeeze down here. And there's enough pouches to last her for the week. I have some more Premier Protein. I haven't started exercising yet. So I haven't had to have any of these because I haven't had any cravings or anything like that. I have one pasta sauce. I don't need that. We have... Um, peanut butter we do have some backup ketchup and back there y'all can see we have some what is that mustard I have actually I have one barbecue sauce and y'all actually do have Italian sauce I wonder when this like expires this is 2025 so I don't need to buy another one perfect because I did put one on there to um purchase 
And this is why it's important to shop your pantry first. Oh, y'all. And we do have like a lot of beans and stuff. So, um, um, I can take those two things. I can only, I'm just going to get one barbecue sauce. Let me see what flavor sauce this was. This was original. Okay. So I can do that. Um, take one off and then take the Italian dressing off. We are good on coffee because I think this was a, let's see. Um, this is an 80 count and we literally just opened it. So I don't need to buy more. Good to see that I actually have more helm and mayo because I'm thinking for the days that I cook, uh, the days that I cook is coming to me fish. We won't take that for lunch. So I'll make some sandwiches. So I am buying some meat for that. Um, we have enough sour cream, um, and that's why I was happy because there's like a little bit of mayo left in here. And then, um, I don't know how good this is y'all, but the jello I can still enjoy. Me and baby girl can enjoy, but a while back I had got this Oikos yogurt and we never actually ended up eating any of it. And I just feel terrible that it's going to go to waste. It actually would have just expired yesterday, October 31st. It's been sitting in the back of my fridge. So you know what I'm going to do? The next four days, I am going to eat yogurt and eat that up so it doesn't have to go to waste. Um, I am almost out of heavy whipping cream, so I have plans to get that and also eggs because I don't have any eggs. So um, I'm just taking out my lunch, y'all, because it is Friday morning. So take those two things off. That's just what the pantry's got going on and the fridge. So I will show you guys next my grocery haul on what exactly I got from HEB and or Walmart because I didn't show y'all, but I only have one box of bubbly left. And now that I am making sure I have a lunch every day, eight of those won't be enough for the week. So I may need to do a small grocery haul from Walmart because Walmart is the place where they have like the bubblies. HEB is always like a hit or miss. So we'll see. Y'all will get to see it when I get back in. All right, you guys. So I am back. I did my HEB pickup. I want to say it was like $145 or $150. So let me show you guys everything that I picked up. So first things first, for a snack, I did some smart food um, popcorn because the carb count is actually like pretty decent on here. It's only eight grams of carbs. I'm not eating this every day, but like one Saturday, like one time on a Saturday, if I'm like hungry, I can have this or good for my husband for snacking. I did pick up some more bread because we'll have sandwiches this week just because of the different meals that we are going to be having like I spoke about. Um, I am consuming a lot of eggs right now. So I got us two 30 count cage free eggs. So that is 60 eggs and hopefully this will last us for the month. But I'm just thinking three. So this is 10 days. 30 eggs will kind of last us for nine. Yeah, nine, eight, nine days maybe. Because the weekends we all eat eggs. Whereas during the week. I'm just having three eggs, so um, we'll see how that works out. I'm just trying to get this bag from under here, you guys. Okay, so those were the eggs. Then I was getting some fruit. So the first fruit I got was these red grapes. So we have some grapes to enjoy because the two that we have are pretty much done. I did pick up some meat, so I did get some chicken legs. I don't think that I'm making chicken legs this week, but at least I have it. Since I kind of overspent this month, then some of these things will carry on for next week. Um, I also picked up some chicken thighs. Always love to have chicken thighs in the house. 
they go perfect into the air fryer so i have that as well and like i said i don't think i'm doing chicken thighs either um i picked up some salad so i did this chipotle and cheddar because i have plans to mix it with another salad whenever i figure out where that one is didn't think the bag was this small but they be getting me sometimes but I did these um, breaded nugget shaped chicken patties. Um, I think it would be good for maybe lunch or dinner tomorrow and then some for baby girl throughout the week. So we'll see how that goes. Um, oh, this is not bad at, bad at all. For six nuggets, this is 14 grams of carbs. So at six nuggets though, that's like filling with a side. Um, next, I got Baby Girl from Goldfish, so she has that for a snack. Uh, here is the other salad. We have this big garden salad because I made the decision to not buy salad thinking the salad that I had was going to be good. That was a no-go. So here we go for the garden salad. Um, then I got baby girl some happy tots. So what is this? Three, six, seven. But I just got her some of these, y'all. It's a whole bunch of them. I'm just going to leave them in the bag right here. And I will put those up. I did pick up some bacon because the bacon that I saw in the fridge just didn't look too kosher. And so just in case it's not, we have some bacon for my husband and baby girl for breakfast. I've been craving some oranges, so they had some um, navel oranges. These are the smaller ones, so um, I got six of them, so I'll be enjoying them because I almost want like an orange now. I got a cucumber to snack on for lunches throughout the week. For another snack, mostly my husband, I got one of his favorite trail mix, and these are the sweet and sassy. So he can mix between having this and um, the pistachios. I got these slow cooker liners. I may not be using it this week. Oh, actually I am because I'm putting the ribs in the slow cooker. But y'all, I did an event at my job and one of my residents told me to get it. And it was so good, y'all. So good. Like the cleanup was so easy. Um peanut butter crackers for baby girl she hasn't had these those in a while and then i actually picked up some what okay it was in spanish so i was like what is this but i did some peppermint tea to enjoy because i've been drinking tea in the evening and they didn't have my favorite which is bigelow um, I got a big thing of heavy whipping cream because I've been drinking some, uh, like a little bit more heavy whipping cream. I got some Mystique ham and turkey breast for those sandwiches that we're going to be making maybe for lunch on Saturday. I'll have that. I got some cream cheese for my chicken and broccoli because I'm pretty sure we're about out. And I know my husband's been eating through the cheese. So I got some more cheese slices. I'm going to be doing barbecue ribs. There we go. Barbecue ribs. So I got two things of baby back ribs for the dinner. And then I got baby girl two of her Jimmy Simmons. Cause they come in handy so the apple and kale and blueberry and then y'all lastly i got some barbecue sauce and i only did one barbecue sauce because i already have one in the pantry and um that's so good that i go and make sure that i check my pantry before i buy stuff so that is my grocery haul I'm supposed to do a Walmart haul, so I'm not gonna say that this video is done yet until it's done, but I'm supposed to do a Walmart haul too because there's some things that I'm missing that I need. So I'll see y'all back here in a bit.